East Asia formed the National League of Families. In 1971, Mrs. Michael Hoff, whose husband was among the missing, contacted Annan and Company, one of the largest manufacturers of flags in the world. She asked them about providing a flag for soldiers captured and missing. Newt Heisley, a pilot during World War II, took on the project to create the flag. As a veteran, the call for a flag design to raise awareness for our nation's POW MIAs was a personal challenge. He began to imagine what life must be like for those behind barbed wire fences on foreign shores. Slowly, he began to sketch the profile of his son, working in pencil to create a black and white silhouette. He added barbed wire and a watchtower. His black and white pencil sketch was accepted, and before he got a chance to refine it or to add colors, it was being printed in quantity. The design for the POW MIA flag was never copyrighted. It is everyone's flag. The POW MIA flag represents all the prisoners of war and those missing in actions from all of our nation's wars and conflicts. Its presence serves to remind us that while we enjoy the privileges of freedom, somewhere there are soldiers who have not been accounted for. Behind the black and white silhouette is a face we can't see. The face of a husband, a father, a son, a wife, a mother, a daughter, who has paid with their freedom for our freedom. Beneath the image are the words, you are not forgotten. <laughs>